continue to update you on that story throughout the day. And this may cause you to lose your appetite. Seven on your side investigates supermarket employees caught breaking up frozen poultry by throwing it to the ground. And this is not the first health complaint at this particular market. Investigative reporter Danielle Lee here with the exclusive video. Lauren and David, it goes without saying this is not the way you handle food intended for sale. A consumed viewer sent us this video, so we decided to pay the food farm in Valley Stream, Long Island, a visit and see what the owner had to say about it. It looks like an activity you'd see in a high intensity workout, only that's no sandbag and that man isn't working out. He's an employee in the food farm butcher department and that object he's repeatedly slamming to the ground happens to be frozen poultry. Some of it wrapped in plastic. That's disgusting. We showed the video to customers at the Valley Stream grocery store. How do you feel about that? Uh, not too good. <laughs> Who had a sudden loss of appetite. Throwing, you know, food on the floor like this. No. That's bad business. The State Department of Agriculture regulates supermarkets, and according to them, intentionally causing raw meat to come in contact with the floor would qualify as a critical deficiency, something that could cause foodborne illness and would render the product subject to New York State seizure. So what was this guy thinking? We asked the folks in the food farm butcher department. Is this what you guys typically do with raw meat that comes into the store? No, this is the frozen stuff. But even frozen meat to throw it on the floor is not okay. No, yeah, I know the frozen stuff is not frozen. This is a box. No, this is the box is no, no open. No, no open. This is not a box. This is a piece of chicken. Watch. Shaman took a closer look and told us that guy wouldn't be working at the store anymore. Other employees seen with him reminded this behavior is absolutely against store policy. Oh my God, this is what they're selling. Before this incident, now under investigation by the state, Food Farm had received four health and safety complaints in less than two years requiring corrective action. The store passed its latest inspection in December 2017. And while customers say they love this market for the prices, this flying poultry is somewhat hard to forget. I would never shop there again. I wouldn't buy it anymore. Probably not. just get my vegetables here now. Food Farm told us that they don't believe that poultry ever made it to their shelves, and they assured us they take this incident very seriously. The store will be subject to follow-up inspections by the state to ensure that this behavior is not repeated.